dinner time. It's time to unwind, socialize, and pleasure the taste buds with an excellent dish. After a good day's work, there's nothing that recharges the batteries quicker than a great dinner. There are so many positive emotions and experiences associated with the meal, which is why the presentation is just as important as the cooking. You want your crewmates to cheer up as soon as they see your dish. Let's talk tips to making a dish that's a feast for the stomach and the eyes. The human sight and sense of taste are connected, and if you have both senses in mind while you're choosing ingredients and planning the serving, you'll leave your crewmates with a positive impression, even if the food itself isn't exactly fancy or expensive. Think contrasts. If, for example, you're serving pasta, try to find ingredients that don't have the same colour, shape or texture as the beige pasta. How about tomato red? creamy white or dark brown. The palette is endless, and so are the possibilities. Top the pasta with more contrasting colours. For instance, use fresh parsley or sliced onions. Use trays that look nice. White porcelain, decorative bowls and glass plates are much nicer than grey, stainless trays and steel pots, which can be found in most kitchens. If you make an eye-catching presentation, the atmosphere on board is given a boost. Almost as important as the spices you use in the kitchen are the words you use to spice up the presentation. When you describe your menu on a board, use words like steamed, slow-cooked and roasted to highlight your cooking method and words like hot, creamy and sizzling to emphasise your dish's unique character. A delicious description will have mouths watering before the dish has even been served. And make sure to specify where the raw materials come from. It's a nice gesture, which the crew will appreciate. <laughs>